Learning from a native. Always listen to the locals. They know more about the environment than you do. And some of them are a lot bigger than you are. Worshipping pagan gods. You never know when you might need just a little bit of help. And you can fix it when you get back. But I liked making flower garlands, frolicking with the beef loaf, and those pig parties. My gracious, those were fun. What do you mean I need a stockpile? I want my stuff back, you bastard. Learning to share with others. Well, what the hell, you only live once. I already have two of these. So we have what? Now, I wonder if I could put that in a crock pot. I couldn't put the raw one in. Nope, can't put it in. So anyway, I'm going to eat it. <laughs> I don't know if you can still make it into a hat or not. One thing I'm short on is actually spider web. Uh, what the hell was I thinking? Down here. Dapper vest, breezy vest. No, nope, can't make it out of the cooked one. <laughs> uh, so anyway, we're at 180 and 73. Well, there was a lot in that puppy. There you go. It's tasty uh, colophon snout. Now, you don't want to go near colophon with uh, colophon snout on your breath. <laughs> Uh, well, the big news, I feel like there ought to be like a breaking news thing on all this stuff I've got. Uh, now, I'm not, I'm kind of glad I didn't bother to uh, go two squares high on these all the way around because obviously from, I've seen, uh, I watched Riptide uh, Pal kill the uh, McTuss the McBlowgun father and son team, and I'll probably keep saying brothers, so, you know, get over it. <laughs> no offense. <laughs> the verbal dyslexia is not affected by updates, thank you. But, uh, yeah, I think that's the only... Uh, there's one over here. Uh, and Deer Clops. Deer Clops looked like he was uh, remarkably stupid. I did put in a comment that I think that uh, for whatever reason, I think Riptide Pal did the right thing fighting uh, Deer Clops at his base because it's kind of like dropping meat for hellhounds. They get distracted and you can do whatever you want to them. Uh, I think Deer Clops is cycled to continually go after your structures and you might build some fake structures, you know, or whatever. I don't know, there's a limit to how much crap I want to do for winter, to tell you the truth. I'm so sick of stockpiling. It's like, you know, bite me. Uh, but anyway, you might want to... Uh, let's see. Oh, anyway, I think uh, Deer Clops is set to uh, go after structures, and it gives you time to do whatever you want to to him. Also, the pan pipes evidently... Uh, Alright, so that 704 did see the recipe at the end. It's one mandrake. Uh, I want to say five reeds and one rope. You might check on that. But there is, the pan flute does now call for a mandrake. So, depending on your world, you'll have either three to five probably mandrakes. And I've gone along. I don't look for the damn things, but and I don't explore as much. This may not work out. I'm watching him and my walls. <laughs> you son of a bitch. You're going to do it again, aren't you? God damn it. Well, I guess you're just not fit company, are you? Bring your ass over here. We'll just take you someplace else. Obviously, you can't be in civilized company. So anyway, you only have a certain number of pan flutes, but I don't know. If he went down that easy to a pan flute, maybe sleeping darts, uh, fire darts while he's destroying the structures you built for him or the structures that are in your base. Uh, maybe he gets, I don't know if he gets distracted in the forest or not. Uh, I guess I should have grabbed a, I don't know what to do with this big son of a bitch. 
I think I should grab the trap. I don't have any food on me either. Watch me die making a video. Come on, Fatso. Get your ass over here. I need food. There you go. Now just stay the hell away from my walls, you son of a buck. I'll sell you into to wood slavery in, in some place that does, uh, well, obviously wood slavery. Screw it. I don't care what I eat. All right, let's, uh... Hollow Dow, H O L I D O W, gave me the video for the uh, the video the first one I saw, the video link for the origin thing on Wilson. It's up in forums. I'll put a link to the one in forums up in this uh, video. Uh, closer or closer, Henry uh, actually told me it was in forums because other than that, I had like a video that kind of led to a single. <laughs> kind of one person with one view it was like what the hell is this so but uh closer henry led me to the uh to the forum link so but anyway it's evidently just a foul story wilson well i won't ruin it for you watch it you'll enjoy it to me it's just a foul story it's just you know and and evidently things were were left in a state of flux by Wilson going through so that it was possible for other people to also I don't, I don't know how much that ruins uh, when I'm tired I do ignorant stuff in fights I mean more ignorant than normal kind of curious why did he hit my wall you big bastard. I was joking about the walls, you shit. Now they supposedly fixed that for me, Flo. I may have to take him somewhere else. Well, you big hard-headed fuzzy top shit. Well, that's a new one on me. I had never heard of that one. Don't you hit that wall, you bastard. Why is he doing that? What they said was in the code, it was a neutral mob. Evidently, it's in his way. Well, you big hunk of fat crap. You're lucky I want you for something or I would kill your fat ass. Well, there's a flaw in the damn plan. Why don't you come and bring your ass out here and live? Don't do anything stupid, you big bastard. I just mean hurting my walls. My walls didn't do anything to you, you shit. Don't even go back over there. I'll make 20 fire darts like they had in the video and light you up like a Christmas tree on fire. Because you wouldn't actually be lit up like a Christmas tree. All right, well, I'm going to take a little break. And uh, shit, as per usual, we learned something else. There's a damnedest stuff will happen in the game. And you go, what? Where'd I put all those rocks? Shoot. Now, I was getting an RMB repair with regular stones, and I want to know what's up with that, too. Is that some kind of glitch? Now, that's just a stone. Well, kiss a duck. Now, I didn't actually repair it that time. So, what about these ones? Well, it's probably wasteful because there's only one stone in each. Uh, I need to eat something or I'll die. Well, I won't die. We could go get some mandrix. Uh, I wouldn't mind bringing one back alive just for the halibut. Uh, what do we need to bring back one alive? I was trying not to... Uh, use any of this crap I was just gonna keep it all stockpiled for winter I'm also kind of torn I don't like doing what's in other people's videos but sometimes it's the best way to do it it's like I hate to kill the damn thing with fire darts after he did it's like well here's me doing what Riptide did <laughs> so I don't know I was thinking about sleep darts and I don't know I, I told somebody that uh, I kind of wish I hadn't seen him kill him because it kind of destroys the whole mystery and uh, fire 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 is the devil's only toy but it kind of destroys the mystery of the whole thing when you've uh, what do I want to say 
It destroys the mystery when you've seen him killed because it's like, oh, well, I'll just do that. So let's go get some mandrakes and I'll talk while we're going to do that. I'm kind of... With everybody having backup saves now, not everybody, uh, I've never done a death, a save to death with a backup save. I'm not saying if I will or won't. You know, it's it's in my heart not to do it. But to tell you the truth, when uh, bed rolls came out, and where the hell did I put my backpack? There it is. When bed rolls came out in Minecraft or beds, I was of the school that. Uh, I'm not going to use these things. It's, you know, it, it'll ruin the game if you just do daytime and build all the time. And then, of course, they came out with creative and you flew and did but daytime and build all the time. <laughs> it's like, okay. So I'm not in the business of saying what I'll never do anymore. But I guess you can... I don't know what all's unlocked to start with. I won't until the update's up. But it seems that if, if with backup saves to prevent death, and uh, if you're using them, I'm, like I said, I'm by no means saying everyone is, but if you've got backup saves to prevent death, and you've got, uh, you can set winter for whatever you want, and I'm not dogging that at all, because I tell you what, if winter just turns out to be me stocking up for winter, doing winter, stocking up for winter, doing winter, you know, et cetera, et cetera, I'll probably be uh, adjusting winter, so it's not, you know, 20 out of, what, 50 days is kind of the implication. I, and I really wish that Kevin would have a list of questions that uh, came from viewers. Pardon me, not from viewers, but from forums over a period of time. You know, hire a goddamn secretary and have her look at what people want to know about winter and bring that damn list with you because you intimidate the hell out of the people interviewing you. And... Uh, what else do I want to say? Oh, and, and the people watching it, you know, they're this part of them are this guy's regular person's regular viewers, and they want to talk about this game or that game or the other game. Some of them have never played Don't Starve in their life, so they're like asking, Can we have boats? <laughs> it's like, Can we ride the beefalo? And it's like, Well, that really fits into the game we're playing. <laughs> and anybody that wants boats and, and wants to ride the beefalo, I'm not knocking you, but. Kevin said, I can't imagine how him, you know, committing evil and being doomed to this island <laughs> equates into him riding war buffaloes. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's just funny. Uh, but <laughs> he didn't say it in those words, but, you know, give me a break. It's not a, a, a Wilson going to war against the armies of the Spider Queen on a war buffalo. I mean, don't get me wrong, I think that's a hell of a game you got planned, but... <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it's not this game. <laughs> oh, crap. But, it, and, and, you know, you're going to have some of those questions, but good grief. Talk about the goddamn update. Nah, screw it. Talk about the goddamn update. I mean, how long is winter? When does winter arrive? Uh, does the grass grow? Do the bees produce honey? Uh, pig aggro. What is the pig aggro? Is there something we ought to know? And if it's secret, just say, well, you'll have to find that out for yourself. And we'll know that we have to find that out for ourselves. But, you know, don't just... Uh, I knew about as much about winter after Kevin was on as I did before because he wasn't asked the right questions. And again, that's not his fault. It's not anybody's fault. It's just the way it is. Now, I was told if you pick these with space bar, it kills them. Shit, and we're in wear pig time. Damn it. I was going to go ahead and try to get two of them back. I don't know where the other little rat turd is. I don't know why they're not following me. They're supposed to follow you. That's never happened before. Where the hell are they? They don't follow anymore? Alright, that one's follow. Oh, I'll bet you only one follows you. I never tried to get two back. Well, I'm not going to know where your idiot brother is. We should have just picked him. This is probably not worth the effort. It'll take two nights to get him back. Barring work pig invasion. 
because we are in uh, we're big time of night or time of the moon or whatever yeah the problem with these is just the distance involved and there's no advantage to taking them home alive it's just uh you're not hungry Wilson you can eat in the daytime you can eat when you die ha ha I think that was a were pig, which means actually we don't want to go all the way up to this village up here. Shoot. Well, there's one to the north of here, too. I don't know what to do with you, little buddy. Well, I, was, I think I'll run back and see if I can get the other one. Okay, now you can eat. I'll bet you I forget where he is. I know this is silly. It ought to be really easy to find him. But anyway, with being able to set the conditions of your world, I I guess the only thing you can look for is uh, somebody to let you know what conditions they're playing under. <laughs>